Welcome back to Blythe Natural Living. I'm your host, Blythe Metz. Today we're talking all about therapeutic natural home spa treatments, things you can make from dry goat's milk that you have in your kitchen. Yay! Joining me is Sierra Parrick. Thank you for being here, sweetie. I'm so happy to be here. Thanks yeah, for having me. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So easy breezy, we're going to make a goat's milk mask. Have you ever used a goat's milk mask before? No. It's very nourishing for your face. Mm -hmm. In fact, it, goat's milk's actually been used since ancient times as a cleanser because it has natural um, alpha hydroxy acids in it. Oh. So it actually sinks in um, to the top few layers of skin and helps exfoliate. Wow. It's fantastic. It's vitamin A, vitamin B6, vitamin B12, vitamin E. It's like super nutrient rich. So I want you to make cool. this. Yay! So what we're doing is we have two tablespoons of dry goat's milk. Um, I get mine from, from naturewithlove.com. Excellent website to go to to get organic. This is organic grass fed. These, oh. these um, treatments are really only as good as their ingredients. So yeah. if you get some like junky, you yeah. know, dry milk, no. Because you want it to be as nutrient dense yeah. as possible because it's delivering nutrients directly to your skin. So we're using two tablespoons of that dry goat's milk and go ahead and put two tablespoons of water in there and then we'll just um, mix, mix, mix. <gasps> mix it up, mix it like up. making pancakes. Yes, it is just like making pancakes. <laughs> so we're going to put the batter on your face. Mm. Yay. So um, this is also really good. Yeah, just get in there. Get in there. <laughs> right. um, whisk. This is super good to put on your hair too. We're not going to put it on your hair now, but it okay. really feeds the hair shaft. It like sinks in. And really like nutrients. a moisturizer. Totally. My hair can get dry. Totally. It's such a good moisturizer for your hair. Cool. And put it, you know, when you do it at home, put it all over. Put it on your breasts. Put it all over everything. Keeps everything Ooh. tight and nourished. Good. That's perfect. So I'm just going to apply this to you because I think it'll be easier. Okay. Ready? Ready. Action. <laughs> Action! <laughs> Hit me. <laughs> Yay. So that's really all it is. It's super nourishing. So this is a moisture mask as well as like an exfoliating mask. So it's kind of cool that you can get both things in one. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. Um, yeah, so it delivers the calcium directly mm -hmm. to the skin. How's it feel? Feels good. Feels goopy. Yeah, feels, feels nice. It's a little goopy, but Just that's great. Cool. So you at home, like I really want to pour this all over your hair right now, but I'm not going to. But you, <laughs> but at home, do it because it's really super good for your hair. Okay. And uh, so leave it at home, leave it on for five minutes. It'll dry a little bit. And then what I do is I get into the shower. And you guys know I love my grapefruit, my ruby red grapefruit washcloths. These so are the best washcloths. They're the best way to remove masks and the best way to apply scrubs. We're gonna be doing a bunch of scrubs on this show and I'll wow. show you. So, and even if you, you know, peel a grapefruit and you don't do a scrub for a couple days, but you keep the peel, they'll get a little dry in the fridge, but then you just put them in water and they just hydrate right back up. Really? And you just use them. And doesn't that smell good? Like it, it really smells, smells so that, good. Totally, you smell you that ruby red. I don't eat the peel. Do you eat the peel? I eat, sometimes I eat orange peels. Oh my god, do you weird? really? That's why you're so pretty. <laughs> That's the secret. So you're a vegan, by the way, too, aren't I'm you? I'm actually just vegetarian now, so the goat You changed. Doesn't Were you vegan bother. before? I was. It was for like a decade. What changed? Um, it just wasn't right for my body. Yeah, you felt like you needed a little... Yeah, yeah so yeah. I use like... like eat like goat yogurt now and goat milk, so it's perfect, and I can put it on my face. Good, absolutely, <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Okay, so what we're gonna do, you're gonna rinse it off your face with these, so just like that, and you can do it too, but then you just take it and kind of open that up. And of course, when you're in the shower, it's a little bit easier. Yeah. But go ahead and try and do it yourself. Just remove, Me. remove the it mask. Do, it does feel like a sponge. It does, doesn't it? Crazy. These are so great. And like I said, you know, just keep them when you eat a grapefruit and, and yeah. they'll rehydrate when you're ready to use it as a sponge or a washcloth. And it makes you eat, at least for me anyway, it makes me eat more grapefruit. Grapefruit is super good for you. <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking I gotta go get some grapefruit. Now. Totally, because then it like, <laughs> gives you your washcloths. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Nature. So how does it feel? It feels good, it feels cleansed, it feels, smells delicious. Good. It smells so good. Good moisture. It feels like I'm getting a sponge back. From Blythe. That's it's right. <laughs> I need a sponge bath with a grapefruit peel. That's it. You pretty much have it all off. Really? That's it. Yeah, oh, cool. Yeah. Get a little off your nose. Boop, boop, boop. There we go. Yay! Yay. So are you going to try this at home with the grapefruit peel? I really am. Yeah. I just have to get some powdered goat's milk. Yeah, you know what? The, the, the salt scrubs that we do 
Um, so many things that you can apply with these peels, even just using them as a washcloth with nothing, yeah. because you're getting, there's so much vitamin C in here and a myriad of other minerals and vitamins that you're putting directly in your skin. You're so right. And the texture is really soft, but it actually helps slough off the dead skin cells anyway. Right. And it so, smells so good. I know, right? And it makes your skin smell really oh good. Oh my gosh. That's it. Yay. So do this at home. Let me know if you have any questions. You can ask me on the Blythe Natural Living Facebook page. And until we meet again, feel good, friends, and good food helps. Hope you liked that video. Please subscribe to my channel. And for more healthy, happy lifestyle living, go to BlytheNaturalLiving.com. See you there.